Tasha Ross, organizer for the George Wiley Center. Hi everyone. Uh, my name is Alicia. I'm a community organizer at the George Wiley Center. Um, the George Wiley Center yeah, is a grassroots organizing for social and economic justice. And so I'm here on behalf of that. Um, affordable housing and rent control is needed everywhere. Basically, catering to wealthy developers during the middle of a housing crisis in a pandemic. For the last few years, I have interacted and encountered several people um, in Providence and in, in Pawtucket un unable to get affordable housing on account of the rents too high or because of their background, which, which results to homelessness and um, squatting. Um, prices are very unaffordable, like especially if the minimum wage is ten dollars and fifty cents an hour. You know, if you add that all up, it comes to about one thousand seven hundred and twenty dollars a month. And that's without taxes. And out of that, you're paying rent, utilities, food, child care, etc. Um, or making or having to make, you know, choices on what bill to pay and what not, what bill not to pay. Um, I know a young woman who has three children and is expecting another baby. And um, she, for because of her background. She's unable to rent an apartment, so she's been squatting from like one house like every six months to the next house every six months. And I also know a woman that has seven children and the landlord wouldn't rent to her because she had seven children and she ended up having to live in an abandoned house. So it's just, you know, this whole thing about them trying to you know, take over. What we really need in Rhode Island is rent control and affordable housing and for all to, to unite and have solidarity and fight for what is right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.